Whole chicken bento. What is red? It turns out that this bento, whole chicken weighing up to 1 kilogram, burst the bento box. You can sell 500 pieces in one day during the holiday, and will sell whole chicken bento, the boss Su Hongrong said. Because of the egg shortage a while ago, this idea was born. He has opened a shop many times and failed in the end. But never expected. Now rely on the whole chicken bento. Out of a new way. Come on chicken. Grab the chicken. When the time comes, golden fried chicken. Ready to cook. At this time, the door of the store, already lined up with a lot of hungry diners. Waiting. Everyone for. Super surging. Fried whole chicken bento. I come from Pingxin today. I want to order a fried whole chicken rice today. Discuss with colleagues before. Also discussed. Just come here to try it out. Willing to wait as long as possible. Only 130 is very cheap. In order to buy this whole chicken bento, how long to wait? About an hour. See the whole chicken sells for 130. Feeling worth it. Located in Longtan, Taoyuan, near Longyuan Palace, this convenience store, the sign at the door reads. Buy a bento and get a whole chicken for only 130 yuan. And inside the bento, serve with three side dishes. There is also minced meat rice topped with secret marinade. Portion super solid. Not yet noon. There are loyal customers coming to report. How long is the queue before I have an impression? Almost to the 8th store. Go in the back alley. So hundreds of meters. 2 to 300 meters. Customers work harder than us. They sometimes really. Even in the rainy day. Even in the rainy day. I think they are really crazier than me. And in line to stand for the ambulance. Too hot to pass out. Right. And what about hypoglycemia? Even in midsummer. Scarlet flames. The temperature outside has already soared above 32 degrees. The queue is getting longer and longer. No matter how hot it is, I am willing to wait. Just for a taste. Hello. A whole chicken is good. Hi what do you want today? A whole chicken. Stick to the chicken fried to order. Once peeled, it's full of gravy. Under the crispy skin, chicken covered with soft cue. Charming taste. Can make girls disregard image. Directly on the spot. Eat up. Everything is freshly made. Then crispy. And then I thought I thought it would be very bad. The results seem to be good. Then the bento is big. I want to say that 130 seems a bit cheap. Will the boss make money? Crisp coat. Then match it with. Very tender chicken. Bite down is full of happiness. The skin is crispy. Inside the gravy. Can still stay inside. With the general outside. Fried chicken meals. Completely different. Because the fried chicken outside. Fried too old. Especially from Taipei. Come here on a heavy machine. Long tan. I think 130 is worth it. Great value fried whole chicken bento. Although one is only 130 yuan. It's just selling at a loss. But it can gather crowds from all over the place. Boss ball. Think it's worth it. Talk about why you had this idea in the first place. He explained it was, because a while ago, egg famine in Taiwan. Inspire his creativity. Why are there no eggs? Is there no chicken? Then put this. Move your brains to the top of the chicken. Then want to say. No eggs to eat. Let's eat chicken. This is how whole chicken bento was born, but even if it's cheap. This material is a little. Dare not be sloppy, we come out and do it, we'll use it differently from others. Because we use small chickens. About the same. About 60 days, to grow. That is, generally this kind of chicken is everyone, bring it to the restaurant, used for desk. After cutting it off some excess fat. Some guts clean it up. When it explodes like this, it will. There won't be some in it, like some dark, some bloody parts. Then use the special Chinese medicine 5 spice powder, pickled. There are some in the powder. There are also some like Chinese medicine powder, some allspice, pepper salt, etc. Sugar or something, different from traditional, marinated without soy sauce. Instead, use spice powder. Dry pickling method, go down and massage. I have to spend the night on ice at the end. Let the chicken taste. Come again to put the oil pan. Control time and temperature. It's very important, relatively more difficult. Because it needs to be heated evenly inside and outside. That's why we have to keep moving it. So you have to keep flipping it. It won't be when the outside is already scorched. It won't be when the outside is already scorched. Not cooked inside. Don't think he has a good way of cooking. Ten years ago, 
He's the owner of a computer repair shop. Later influenced by smartphones. Performance is not as good as before. Then I turned around and devoted myself to the catering industry that I was interested in, when I was about to leave the industry. Everyone must be laughing. Because we started with screwdrivers. Person with a screwdriver. Suddenly need to get a kitchen knife. That won't even take it. Then I often chop my hands, for what? All those surrounded by relatives and friends, not optimistic at all. But he insisted on starting as an apprentice. After I finished my studies, I found my friend Mark. Start a partnership. This this business, 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 all failed. Chicken rice duck rice. Hong Kong style, yum cha malatang. Grilled chicken and Thai shrimp. Beef noodle cold noodle shop. Many, many, down. Almost endless. We should soon be like the father of the nation. Eleven revolutions. Is we actually engaged in many industries? The failure rate is very high. Maybe. Maybe it's because they don't know the industry. Then we are all also engaged in catering. So for the catering market. Also slowly familiar. Even if you fail so many times, make them more frustrated. Learn from failure. No matter how much money you lost. They started all over again half a year ago. Pack spaghetti fish chicken. Leaving Taipei and choosing to open a bento shop in Taoyuan. All or nothing. Except the evil of whole chicken bento. We also sell pork rib bento in the store. It doesn't need to be powdered. That's what makes it final after the kiss. Wait a while to marinate. Common grilled pork ribs in western restaurants. The way of cooking here. But full of Taiwanese flavor. Fry until half cooked. Next, get ready for the stew. Part of the marinade. Just have some of that. Onion, ginger, shrimp, star anise. Cinnamon these Chinese herbal medicines. Go down and fry. Put it in after frying. Then add our salted buns like this. Added 13 kinds of spices to marinate. 40 minutes with fire. Such marinated ribs taste delicious. The meat is tender and fragrant. The texture of the ribs. He fried it first and then marinated it. Then when you bite down, full of garlic flavor. Full bodied. Some people will say, this rib is a bit different. I agree. At least you bought. Won't be sorry. Do you understand? What you buy is worth it. I can buy ribs bento for 101. Where to buy? Can't buy it at all. Our single order of two large ribs. We are selling 60. We're just trying to get some parity. Something everyone can afford. 440 yuan. Come thank you. Dark guy. Same cheap. And this thick, cut leg bento. Is also very popular. Delicious secret. Have to go through two processes. This leg library we have now. That is to say, after shaving. Throw it down and fry it like this. The oil temperature is about. About 180 degrees. Perfectly locks the essence of gravy. Brain to shiny leg library. Thin skin and lots of meat. Taste fat but not greasy. Make people eat more and more. In order for consumers. More diverse choices. The boss develops more items. Tea leaves using sun moon lake black tea. Tea goose. Strong tea aroma. Good appetizer. You have put some material aroma. When going down to do the stacking. You will have better taste. A whole chicken. And then a cold noodle? Good. Step by step. Make every effort to get results. Whole chicken bento now. It is not a problem to sell 500 pieces in one day during the holiday. It also boosted the buying momentum of other items. Business is also slowly on track. They cherish. Do any one thing. You just do your part. When you do your part. You will shine. Just don't do it mediocrely. We must think of something. Let the catering industry be like this. Just to break through. Not afraid of failure, right? We are. We actually closed down so many stores. We still insist. We will succeed. Break the hand bone, upside down brave. Although the store failed many times. But they have a foolish spirit. Relying on creative bento, to turn over. Deliberately persist. One day your own entrepreneurial path. Will succeed. There's a home here in Taiwan. Chow Main King, known to locals. Fragrance has been around for 10 years. The signature fried noodles are full of steam. The ingredients inside are almost as much as noodles. Here you can also eat all kinds of stir-fry. 
like sweet and sour fish fillet with golden sand tofu, with Wu Gun and so on. The founding boss has worked hard for many years, unexpectedly died of cancer. Dying words. Let Chiu Ijuan, the godmother who used to be a social worker, just jump down and take the sign. Because of her own life, I have also experienced many downturns, so she started to eat. Free heart lunches are also provided every day. Let's take a look at her story. Noodles into hot pan, quick stir fry over high heat. The rich sauce is tangy. All its condiments, this part is different from others. And it starts from the cooking part. Probably not. One and a half minutes. Fast enough. Only by frying can the right pot gas be obtained. The ingredients in this pot are not soft. Almost as much as noodles, shredded pork with cabbage, onion, carrot, and fungus. Every bite is surging. Unique sauce for noodles. A strong aroma. The noodle retains the chewiness of the Q-bomb. Suck the noodles while it's hot. The most refreshing and delicious. Every meal time. The delivery order is full. The takeaway part is too soupy. That noodle part. The taste will not be the same, it will be too soft. The soup part will do. Take a little bit. Various tastes. Beef, sheep, shrimp, shredded pork and three delicacies. This taste has been fragrant in Taoyuan for more than 10 years. It is the famous king of chow mein. At that time only relying on the simple and delicious dish of fried noodles. Just stand firm and make a name for yourself. Fried rice is a must here. Different from the juicy fried noodles. Fried rice with crispy grains. Glossy luster tempts appetite. Naturally sweet vegetables. Served with plump and crispy shrimp. A seemingly simple meal. Kung Fu is hidden in this grain of gold. It is also a must for many gourmets. This bowl of good taste. It is from the hand of Chiu Ijuan, who is called Sister Chiu. She used to be a medical social worker. I don't know anything about food. From complete layman all the way to this. Internal operations management procurement. Then the customer's response advances and retreats. Then cost control. I think this part. Just think of it like me before. In the medical field, interaction between family and patient. Show 100,000 points of patience. Start slowly with basic skills. The first store was started by Sister Cho's brother-in-law. One spatula. That's how the store was propped up. But just three years ago, God brother was diagnosed with cancer unfortunately. In and out of the hospital afterwards. In the end, I still failed to overcome the challenge of the disease. His last wish in his hospital bed. Let Joe's sister resolutely. Just jump out. Carry this signboard that cannot be given up. He was at that last moment. That's what he told me. Hold my hand and talk to me. Sis, keep doing it. That's it. He told me three sentences to continue. I wanted to give up. But I think his eyes are full of that pleading and praying. I promised him then. I said okay, I'll keep doing it. Just to keep the promise with my brother-in-law, don't look at Miss Chiu's petite stature. She has a neat short hair. There is also a spirit of not admitting defeat when doing things. In addition to fried rice, there are many hot dishes here. Onion garlic bell pepper etc. All processed on the same day. Put it in the pot immediately to keep the fresh and sweet taste. The aroma of garlic explodes in the pot. The bright red sweet and sour sauce is also boiled together. Freshly fried fish nuggets. Pour it all in. Stir fry heat and time. Test your cooking skills. Shake the pot vigorously. Let the sauce coat the fish evenly. Dory part is. It's crispy on the outside and soft on the inside. The color part is beautiful. The taste part is because it is completely without thorns. So it's okay for the elderly. Children are okay. Fried fish with caramel color. The outer layer is full of sauce, oily and shiny. The entrance is crispy. Then the sour and sweet merged in the mouth. The inner layer of fish is juicy and tender. If you love heavy flavors, don't miss out on this five watching sausage.
The boiling soup is rolling. The bright red color makes the index finger move. With a spicy fragrance rushing to the nose, it looks like it's too full to pick up. The large intestine is stewed just right, fat and tender. The boiled duck blood is full of sauce. Bite down, mouth is full of spicy fragrance. Although it cannot be used internally due to the epidemic, but good taste is well known locally. The phone calls for delivery are also one after another. 20 minutes okay. One seafood chow mein, shrimp fried rice for one. Okay, thanks bye bye. All kinds of side dishes are ready and lined up before noon. The hand that packs the bento has never been idle. Packed in a box and bagged. Sister Chiu carried it on her own. Deliver bento to customers in person before the store opens. Deliver bento to customers in person because she still has a very important task. Just rush back to the store to prepare a charity lunch. Free to those in need. Do the right thing. Never feel tired, not tired at all. Just chasing time, chasing time. Then just go ahead and do. Because this is actually a driving force behind. Charity bento is free. The materials are not sloppy. All kinds of side dishes. Sausage layered on white rice. This amount is useless. Just treat it like a rice bowl. Is there too much material? I keep filling it up, you know what I mean? Don't want it to have a gap, yes yes yes. Actually it looks like this, the grandma who ate, they opened it to see, I'm in a good mood. The opening time has not yet arrived, there's already a long queue outside the door, grandparents, waiting for a warm bento. One by one, thank you thank you. Come thank you thank you. People can't just care about themselves. The meaning of life is if you can pay. Is the greatest blessing. I feel like I've been so miserable. There must be someone more miserable than me. The idea of helping people. It is from Sister Cho's twists and turns in her past life. After marriage, a baby girl was born. I thought the family would go on happily ever after. Unexpectedly, the creditor suddenly came to the door. That's when she found out that Mr. was addicted to gambling outside. She must come forward to negotiate with creditors. At that moment, when the debt is to be repaid, car, door opened. Are not closed yet. As a result, sir, he stepped on the gas pedal and he ran away. I'm on the scene, I'm stupid. One person faces eight or nine debt-collecting brothers. The negotiation process is unimaginably frightening. Trembling. Because there is no such process. Even shaking. I was kneeling over there. That brother will bring the gun right away. Right by the temple. He said no matter what you do today. Just to get the money together. Remember the time. The horrible picture is vivid. But I didn't expect this was just the beginning of the debt. Sir, gambling is something I really can't quit. Can't quit. In a situation where you can't quit, it's just repeating and repeating. Repeat repeat. Repeat to the end tens of millions. In order not to live in fear. Sister Chiao promised to shoulder tens of millions of debts for her husband, in exchange for divorce and custody of the daughter. She became a single mother. With young children. To pay off debts and carry the family. To pay off debts and carry the family. So she ran around day and night to work in the hospital. After taking over the storefront from my brother-in-law. Also like a desperate three mothers. Go to the market every morning to buy. I have to go to replenish in the afternoon. Make sure all ingredients are handpicked. Pick seafood and vegetables. Or some other live fish. The goods are still full. Basically 90%. It has nothing but oysters. Everything else. So it meets the needs of my shop. All those ingredients. So freshness is absolutely okay. Wander through stalls. Pick a lot of ingredients and bring them directly to the kitchen. By same day use. Rich and salty jinja tofu. First put minced garlic and salted egg yolk into the pot. Keep stirring with your hands. Turns into a golden yellow foam at high temperature. Put the chopped green onion and tofu into the pot while it's hot. Part of the heat. Even though small tofu. It's crispy on the outside and soft on the inside. That tofu is tender. Salted egg yolk coated tofu. Meticulous melt in the mouth. It tastes salty, but not greasy, very tasty. 
Serve with a pot of sauerkraut, sliced meat soup, refreshing soup and tender meat. Drink it to warm your heart and stomach. These delicious. It all hides Cho Ijuan's longing for his deceased brother-in-law. I need to talk to him first. Sister Tim did it. Especially today is his. How about a chance? Today is actually his birthday. I want to talk to him. He told his sister. Sister did it. Then if he is alive in heaven. I hope he can help my sister through every difficulty. It can go on and on. Pass on his last wish well. Shoijuan experienced various twists and turns. Turn hardship into motivation. From hospital to restaurant. Unexpected life turn. Unexpected U turn. And turn out more goodwill circles. Mi Sua is an authentic Taiwanese flavor loved by many people. And in this small stall in Zhongli, Taoyuan. Every day can be said to be a long queue. In addition to the common large intestine oyster noodles, and seafood noodle, beef tendon noodles, etc., nearly 10 flavors. In addition, the fragrant fried rice with Q-bombs and sesame oil chicken. Popularity is also very strong. Huang Yingsheng had trouble opening a branch. The adversity of not repaying a loan of millions from a friend. At this time, he received his father. Letter to him on the eve of his death. This heart and love gave Huang Yingsheng great strength. Let him decide to keep working hard. Cook out the good taste that touches people's hearts. One wants parsley and one doesn't. One wants parsley and one doesn't. One more fried rice. The rainy streets of Zhongli, the red lantern on the dining car reveal warmth. The red lanterns of the dining car reveal warmth. Huang Yingsheng. Busy at the stall. Dinner time. Narrow arcade. Already squeezed out. Many people. I will still queue when I want to eat. Sometimes I don't open at 5 o'clock after get off work. I will go home. Come back at about 6 o'clock. Are you addicted a little bit? So now buy again. Sitting here and eating will still make you sweat. But everyone is still willing to wait. Food is worth the wait. Hurry up boss. I'm getting hungry. Okay soon. Sunny smile like a big boy. The neat skills of the chief shopkeeper. Huang Yingsheng, a handsome aborigine of the Ami tribe. It sells the simplest Taiwanese snacks. Mi Sua and fried rice. Play new tricks with copper plate delicacies. Others, noodles, should be mostly, both oysters and large intestines. He is more characteristic of seafood. Then oyster is also a special choice, particularly large. Used to come almost every day. Why do you like to eat so much? I won't get tired eating every day. No, he has many tastes. Like this bowl of signature full plus noodles. Large intestine oyster meat soup, squid, shiitake mushroom and shrimp. Add it all. Eat whatever you want. Too much material, really strong enough. The point is that there is a limited hidden version every day. Fragrant large intestine head, deep fried until crispy and delicious. Braised spicy beef tendon. It's a bit like a military village. Ingenious mix and match. Let gourmets flock. There will be surprises, because the hidden version is different every time. Sometimes curious, what will they have in today's in addition? We'll want to see. What hidden version can be selected today? But in fact, the key to delicious noodles, not just toppings, but from the soup. Unexpectedly costly. Chicken bones are sweeter. Pork bone is rich. This soup tastes good. There will be one after the other. Our Chinese cabbage is its sweetness. Come back to our fishbone words. It is an umami. So there are front, middle, back, up and down. Absolutely no MSG. Instead, use fruits and vegetables to bring out the sweetness. Use pears to stew to make the soup base fragrant. But have an unforgettable good taste. In fact, there is another secret weapon. Because many people will say. How could it be so sweet? And this thing. A clam will take its meat. Muddy. Add in the noodles. Other stores are deeply afraid of others. I don't know I've made a heavy copy. Huang Yingxing did the opposite. All the essence goes into the soup. Leave no trace. Dozens of ingredients. Before some ingredients go into the hot soup. I have to put the oil pan first. Crispy scallion and garlic oil. Dried shrimp and winter vegetables. The aroma of frying is overwhelming. Finally add the recipe. Here comes the key. Together into the pot, sprinkle a large amount of bonito. It's really hard to imagine boiling a pot of noodles. Such a big project. After taste, filter, and clean. Only the clear and rich soup base is left. Thicken the bottom line. Scoop up gently. 
flowing down like a golden waterfall. Just looking at it makes your mouth water. The processing of ingredients is also a big project. Fresh southern squid is crispy and elastic. Huang Yingxing also put the big fat oyster. Wash it clean. Let go. Roll the oysters in a pot to lock in the seafood. Another freshly blanched squid and shrimp. Super cold water increases elasticity. No wonder his seafood noodle. It will be a classic bestseller at food stalls. I think seafood tastes very fresh. I love so much. It's really delicious, that's why we come here often, and we often introduce friends. In fact, Huang Yingxing, in the past, he was the supervisor of the group meal company. Good treatment, high salary, but not greedy for stability, very ambitious. I cook. How old can I be? Just a little dazed. Feel confused about the future. Yeah, so many young lads. In case I'm 50 I'm 60. Can I stay in the kitchen? But I just said that I want to start my own business. I was strongly opposed by my parents. So I had to do two jobs at first. Take advantage of the vacation to set up a stall. Sleep less than three hours a day. Huang Yingxing felt that the tiredness was worth it. More and more friends support me. They will say. Why not open on weekdays? Why only holidays? Business is getting better and better. People are getting more and more. I might sell out in an hour at the earliest. Since then, I feel like saying, make up your mind. Just make this noodle. It's not just noodles that are well received. And this shiny oily rice. There are also many diehard fans. Steaming with a tempting aroma. Drizzle with homemade sweet chili sauce. The mouth is amazing. The more you chew, the more fragrant. Huang Yingxing's fried rice will be delicious. In fact, there are small steps. For example, the water temperature for making glutinous rice is very particular. Many customers will say that my glutinous rice is strange. Why is my fried rice so cute? Just like the outside. Why is the outside sticky? Then it will stick to your teeth. About 60 degrees cannot be too hot. Also not too low temperature. This is my years of research. Researched experience. Steam the rice soaked for one hour in a wooden barrel. At the same time, you have to prepare the ingredients quickly, in addition to common shiitake mushrooms and dried shrimp. Huang Yingxing also added aboriginal ingredients to enhance the taste. Stir fried pork belly and lard in a hot pan. Stir fry until the oil bubbles, then simmer for an hour on low heat. You're done. A spoonful of stir fry and marinade. Sprinkle evenly over the rice. What evaporates is steam. Also old style. The hotter the better. It's not easy to mix if it's not hot. Just love and hate. It's hot. I've had it for four years. Even with two layers of gloves. Still can't stand the high temperature. In a few minutes, Huang Yingxing is already sweating profusely. It's really hard work and delicious. I think oily rice is delicious. Also considered, if you get married later. Just order the fried rice from here. Because the fried rice is to be given away. Of course you must choose a delicious one. Fragrant and not too oily. You see he still has tendon today. Then the taste of kabayaki eel is very changeable. Huang Yingxing also seized the opportunity to expand the branch. Unexpectedly, problems came one after another. I want to take care of the kitchen. I want to take care of the first shop and the second shop. I'm at my wit's end. The first is the issue of personnel. No way to control. Even kitchen work. The SOP is also messed up. The SOP is also messed up. Then the guests start to bounce back. Then the guests start to bounce back. Taste changed. Bad attitude. Relatively will affect, relatively will affect, the business of our second store. How seemingly endless rain, Huang Yingxing met a friend who owed money and refused to pay it back, lost millions. I trust him completely, because I value him more than money. Because I value him more than money, as a result, the time is up. And keep dragging. No one will be found in the back, make me feel tired. I hate to see him exhausted. Parents and elder brother persuaded him to close the second store. Restart. But Huang Yingxing just can't let go. No matter how hard it is, I have to endure it. Unexpectedly at this time, fate hit him again. Always tough dad. Sudden decline in physical condition. Fell down. Huang Yingxing blamed himself even more. It was dad until the last moment. Are still worrying about him. After my dad's funeral is over. After my dad's funeral is over. Found in the mailbox. Found in the mailbox. Found in the mailbox. Why is there a letter from my dad? Then I opened it. It turned out to be. This letter was from my dad before he died. Written to me. The world outside is wonderful. The world outside is wonderful. The outside world is helpless.
Take out daddy on his deathbed. Last letter to myself. This is my father's last concern. It is also the regret of my son's life. He doesn't know when his life will end. He didn't tell me either. Ingsheng, I have written to you to receive a letter. He wrote so much. So much. Fully. He said dad saw your hard work. Very distressed. Feel like your body is going to break down. You're almost 40 years old. And now these things happen again. No one around. He means. I don't have a wife or anything. Yes, we can work together. Then my dad wants to say. I can let go of the second store. You will have less trouble. He wants me to change. So just feel sorry. But I'll take my dad's words. Keep going. This time, Huang Yingxing listened to his father's words. Close the second store. Back to basics and start over. The preparation of materials and stalls are all done in the hands of others. The headmaster and bell ringing is hard work. But the guests are gradually coming back. But the guests are gradually coming back. In addition to the original noodle and fried rice. Also specially innovated unique sesame oil chicken. Its ginger flavor will become fragrant. Soup will become sweet. Natural sweetness. Stir fry in sesame oil to bring out the aroma of ginger. Chicken fried until golden. Pour the whole wine. It changes color. Carefully selected large chicken thighs are tender and tender. There is also yam and cabbage in it. Increase the sweetness of vegetables and fruits. Let's have a bowl of heartwarming and stomach warming. Sesame oil chicken is awesome. Delicious. Very strong. Yes, the meat is also very tender. Don't drink if you don't know how to drink. Because it's really strong. After drinking hot soup, you can also have a refreshing bowl of sweet and spicy. Different from the general. All with rice blood and radish. Huang Yingsheng not only added cauliflower, corn tomato, and crazy. Dream soft boiled eggs. Delicious sauce. If you mix those sauces. Very delicious. See Huang Yingsheng's cooking. So popular. Mama Huang is both happy and sad. On the one hand, worried that his body won't be able to bear it. I can't help but support him. Work hard to fulfill your dream. He does it alone, I can't bear it. That is your dream. It doesn't matter if you keep doing it. So take care. Must work hard. And dedication and enthusiasm for cooking, even after several twists and turns. Huang Yingxing still puts this simple civilian food. Make the most extraordinary delicacy. There is a super popular port. If you want to eat, you have to queue. Would be so welcome. It's because of the boss Daisen. For years in business, developed a taste suitable for Taiwanese. Signature saute beef lo mein. Is made with homemade ugly material. Marinade for more than six hours a day. Serve with sweet and dried lo mein. Sprinkle with clay pot oil of special soul sauce. The taste is rich and fragrant. Egg and shrimp rice. It has pumbai ingredients. Full and sweet. Desserts include peanut butter toast. Thickly coated on the surface. Peanut butter and condensed milk. Stacked layers. It tastes sweet, but not greasy. Evil break. Affordable food for every meal. It has a strong Hong Kong flavor. Let the guests who have eaten visit again and again. Colorful neon lights. Decorated with early Hong Kong. Green background. Match the retro tiles on the ground. This hotel is located in Zhongli, Taoyuan. Tea restaurant in the alley. Push open the door. Make people feel. It's like being in Hong Kong for a second. See the decor. See the decor. Take pictures and then, just want to come. Just cute. I like that color too. Just very special. It just feels like Hong Kong. Shopkeepers are forced to stay open. Think big things in life. Only eat and drink. But the dining time is limited to 90 minutes. Even if you look good. Slogans that make people smile everywhere. Let this store. Attract customers. Rush to visit. It's his taste. It really tastes like Hong Kong. It's a Hong Kong taste in my memory. Is it tasty? Tasty. Full price. And it's big. As usual. For the price of eating Hong Kong style food. I think it's quite cheap. I think it's quite cheap. Not expensive. Furthermore, it actually belongs to. Furthermore, it actually belongs to. Taiwanese style, Hong Kong style yum cha. A lot of people. So we'll just, just say 11.30. He opens the door and we hurry to line up. Don't want to wait too long. Because these are lined up for food. Last time. 
There should be five or six groups arranged like this, waited for at least half an hour. Will be full no matter weekdays or holidays, from basic Hong Kong style lo mein to rice dishes, make dim sum, and must eat dessert snacks. Everyone is a guest. Must order classic delicacies. Our next, saute beef with egg, with a sea salt matsusaka pig. With a Hong Kong style cake, good. Learn to cook, Dai Eason, with more than 20 years of experience, Taiwanese from Xingang, familiar with Hong Kong cuisine, all sauces and recipes, with strong Hong Kong flavor. Signature beef saute. Combine some. The cultures of Hong Kong and Malaysia are in it, so we combine peanut and saute sauce, then Taiwan's culture is San tea sauce, signature beef saute, marinade for at least 6 hours. Let the sauce fully soak into the meat slices. 9 tall chicken drumsticks, freshly made marinade, strong peanut flavor, fill the kitchen. Each of his meat will follow Taiwanese preferences. Homemade different marinades. Part of the spice, it's garlic onion. Yes, then let the meat soften. But we didn't. Doing too much stuff, we tried to present the taste of chicken drumstick itself. Marinated leg steak, fried and crispy on the outside, tender and juicy inside. Served with hot rice. Delicious and filling. Beef saute is fried quickly. The meat is tender and fragrant. Paired with Hong Kong style lo mein, the homemade saute sauce is even more fragrant. It is a good taste that will make people miss after eating. Because there is this secret weapon. The one in our store, sold clay pot oil for sauce. It has no additives. For those in Hong Kong, there are dark soy sauce and light soy sauce. Our Taiwanese soy sauce is very good, so I add Taiwanese soy sauce. Kombu soy sauce will be used on lo mein. Or Guangzhou noodles, or our meal. Very tasty. Very different. Dyson almost every dish will be drizzled with homemade clay pot oil. Will be drizzled with homemade clay pot oil. Not every tea restaurant will do this. Not every tea restaurant will do this. Not every tea restaurant will do this. Because it takes so much effort. Work hard on research and development, but he doesn't bother. Drizzle over rice with egg and shrimp. Served with springy shrimp, fresh scrambled eggs with cabbage. Plenty of ingredients. Just for viewing. Full marks for visual effects. The taste is also 100% delicious. Even the faces are special. Main soul sauce, clay pot oil, scallion oil, and red sauce. These three go mix this lo mein. Fishing means dry. Then we have two faces. One is Guangzhou raw noodles. One is the dal noodle in Hong Kong. The dal noodles are delivered from Hong Kong. That raw noodles are what they usually are. In Hong Kong, they are called Zhuxing noodles. Then it's a bit alkaline. Then generally do that. Their wonton dish is more. Wonton filling made fresh every day. Fresh ground pork. With a whole whole shrimp. Pack a big one. It weighs 30 grams. Like this shrimp is. The unit price is also higher than ordinary shrimp, then it is no potion, then it is hand peeled, I have found in Taiwan, 7 or 8 manufacturers. Can't find. It's still limited. It's still limited. Fresh wonton raw noodles. Wonton tastes cute bouncy and strong. Raw noodles are smooth and tender. With delicious soup, extra large bowl, can make people eat satisfactorily. I have been to Hong Kong once, then eat their lo mein. Then I really like it. The taste of their noodles, eat this is their kind of taste. It's very close. That's why I want to come, keep eating. Then I want to try. Their other stuff, Dyson, who is very demanding on ingredients, know the importance of freshness. Because he was studying. Studying in the Department of Food and Beverage, learned Northern Dim Sum, Southern Point. A chance encounter with Hong Kong-style dining. From then on, he started his entrepreneurial path, because my own family is not very good. Comparing single-parent families, no words. In fact, for future parents, how to take care of this? Do you want to say that Guangzhou died of his ancestors? Yes, feel this way. I just thought about it. Then feel like saying, I feel like I'm the only one left at home. Yes, then I want to be in this aspect myself. Do it well. So I decided, I must open a tea restaurant. Then there are tea restaurants belonging to Taiwan. Four, because of ordinary tea restaurants, are run by Hong Kongers. Yes, it is more Hong Kong taste. He is very talented in research and development. Adjust all ingredients too. Suitable for Taiwanese taste, for years in business. Also experience a shortage of manpower, poor funds. The equipment is not perfect. Manufacturers run away and lose money and other big and small things. Also know how to cook. Not what most people imagine. So simple. When an employee, I feel tired. I didn't expect to think that after becoming the boss, will be easier. Actually more tired. 14 to 16 hours per day for work. Yes, but you have to manage. 
Passenger traffic is increasing, so we do a lot of things. We all become device boosted. More efficient for people. His carrot cake is made and sold every day. Shrimp bacon fresh shredded radish. The materials are not soft. If you have carrot cake, you can eat it. Then it has the taste of radish and it's a sausage, right? Still full, full of delicious. Just eat the real thing. Is handmade. It's right if you can eat it and make it by hand. Yes, eat it. Have you ever tasted it? How about it? It's full of flavor. Full of truth. Fresh radishes, shredded and boiled with water. Add that Cantonese sausage. Saute that sausage. And some Kayong. In rice milk, talk to us again. Stir and evenly. So you'll get some taste. Then my shredded radish is to be done. Cut thicker. So while steaming. Let's steam for another hour. Carrot cake. So it's less likely to melt away. Shredded radish is thicker. You can also taste the taste. Although Dyson. Already the owner of a tea restaurant. But what does he do? Still do it yourself. Poor learning ability in childhood. Heavy inferiority complex. After leaving society at the age of 18. Also walked some roads of no return. Turned around. Still think that by their own labor. The best way to feed yourself, in addition to the staple food, his dim sum. Also very popular. West toast. In fact, I ate it once a long time ago. Then what I ordered this time is, it's peanut butter. In fact, I am more surprised. It's peanut butter is not too sweet. Then inside. It has a slightly salty flavor. I cut it. After eating a few mouthfuls, I found out. It has peanuts and sesame seeds in it. The interlayer is added with peanuts and sesame seeds. It tastes more layered. Then the taste is full. Homemade egg tarts are made and baked daily. Sweet but not greasy. You can get a strong egg flavor. I spire pineapple oil. The intertwined taste is perfectly integrated in the mouth. Fragrant, delicate and milky. With silky milk tea. Perfect match. Silky milk tea is more labor intensive. Taiwan brew black tea. 10 grams can cook 100 cc. Or more than 200 grams. Can only cook 40 cc. And the black tea I chose. There are about 7 kinds. The tea gall that is boiled out of that water. Then hit that tea leaf. In Hong Kong, they would say bump tea. Knock out its strong taste. So we're going to add our custard. Can be silky smooth. His tea is delicious. Good for him Hong Kong style milk tea. Good for him Hong Kong style milk tea. Yes very smooth. This is a must drink. Yes it is a must drink. There are a variety of things sold in the tea restaurant. Everything is his intention to integrate Hong Kong. Delicious meal with Taiwanese culture. Also let the store become a well-known shop that explodes on the internet because I didn't think I could do anything. I have been going on without giving up. In fact, I also wanted to give up because too tired. Then my body was in trouble. Yeah, it's about to fall. I almost fell to the floor once. Fainted. Then encounter any difficulties is that we keep moving forward because it takes a lot of courage. And in the process, I've been doing one too. Grateful person. Then I have the opportunity to take care of. Everyone related to me. With a passion. Go forward. Dai Eason tries his best to do everything well. There is also a lot of growth in the process. Being a boss I think. Experience these people and things and things. To myself. I slowly realize that. It's actually quite beautiful. Then also understand. To experience what true gratitude is. In fact, I am very grateful for teaching me along the way, just all the way back. Taught me some of my culinary arts. Every master. Achievements since opening, more than expected. He also achieved it with persistence and courage. Homemade Hong Kong drink to invigorate the spleen. Cuisine features and value. Cuisine features and value. There is a special stall. Selling hockey and fried noodles. Rare outside. Because it's Malaysian. Contemporary cuisine. Different from ordinary fried noodles. Lu Yunqian. Noodles imported from abroad are used. Add sliced pork and shrimp. And lots of vegetable stir-fry. With special homemade sauce. Very special taste. The most eye-catching is, boss's kung fu of stir-frying. There will be a burst of fire every time it is fried. With a strong aroma of pot gas. Cheap and delicious has become, the most modern of Zhongyu and night market. One of the specialties. How many copies do you want? I want one, and I want spicy. I saw the master frying noodles, look like fire. It feels very fresh and novel. First pass, I saw him fry that noodle, nice heat. Then stop and buy.
feeling great. Then it looks delicious. Crowds of people queuing in front of food stalls. Everyone queues up. Everyone queues up. Just to wait. This is delicious. Hockey and fried noodles. The main reason is that the pot that eats it is right. Because it's hockey and fried noodles. It's quite rare in Taiwan. It is different from ordinary fried noodles. This noodle is really delicious when you open it. Then the material is very real. There is seafood and pork. Then there are a lot of noodles. Nothing to add that chili sauce. Really superb. Elsewhere. I can't eat that special kind. Thinner noodles. Kinda like oil noodle but not. Kinda like oil noodle but not. And the taste is less. In the bustling. Taoyuan Zhongyuan Night Market. There are a lot of copper plate delicacies. But only this stall. Just the aura of the pot is enough to win. Fire to control. Then let it steam. Then don't burn. Lu Yunxian, who is only 30 years old, insists on must stir fry. Only in order to adhere to the aroma of the food pot. Let the guests get. Just can't help it. Stand by the side of the road and have a good meal. But break Baidu's hot pot. How to get the ingredients? All learned. The main ingredient is our seafood meat. After the fire is over. After a bit burnt. We may start. Add our garlic and saute until fragrant. Then download our dishes. After that is almost ripe. We finally face down. Then mix it with our special sauce. Then mix it with our special sauce. And then after frying, almost burnt, after the smell of sauce, we will cook. Start serving customers. Large portion. There are springy and tender shrimp in a fried noodle. Hue bomb squid. Crispy pork slices stir-fried. And rich vegetables. Combining imported exclusive noodles. Seasoned with homemade special sauce. Makes people salivate. One serving, as long as read five minutes, because it's all fried quickly. In one pot, there are only, fried, two servings at most, large portion of chow mein, plus toppings, vegetable sauce, etc. To cook evenly, food can't fill the pot. The box is actually specially selected. It can actually be opened to become a plate. That use. It will be more convenient to put. There will be moisture in the bag. It will affect the taste of our noodles. Lu Yunxian and his wife Li Yijuan. Together in the night market. This is less than one ping booth. It's been two years. We opened at the end of 2019. Then keep doing it, do it now. At first, I read and studied in Taiwan, then later feel that it is not enough. We fly to Malaysia, go buy some books and come back to study. Then after the customer's reflection, re-improved, to start a business, I also fly to study abroad, because it's hockey and fried noodles. It's hard to imagine just by looking at the name. It's from Malaysia, one of the contemporary delicacies. In the early days, for example, Fujian, or Guangdong, they immigrated to Malaysia because of the local weather, so they made this noodle. Most of them are sold by Fujianese, that's why it's called hockey and me. Hockey and fried noodles, because something special, rare in Taiwan. It also gave the couple the idea of starting a business. Actually, we started thinking about a storefront, but then I researched. Found that the cost of the store is a bit higher. Then we want to say that the first time to start a business, then let's try at the night market. Can you do it? I chose several dishes, then finally feel that. This may be more suitable, Taiwanese taste. Night market, not far from school. Then we try to be. Keep our young students well fed. So the wait. We have specifically studied. The stall only sells one item. Seemingly simple. But the preparation process. Also take a lot of time. Different seasons. Then we will ask the vegetable merchants to help us prepare. Let's see which one is the most beautiful and freshest in the season. At a certain cost. We don't want to say we're going to buckle up. That's the cost and that's it. That for such money. Then we try to do our best. Preparation starts at 2 p.m. every day. From cabbage to shrimp, Lu Yunxian has strict requirements on quality. Shrimp's words. We try to choose tropical, near the equator. The shrimp over there, will be bigger. Then look fatter. It will be a little bit crispier when you eat it. Usually we choose white shrimp. Flat Leong, carefully peel the shrimp. The moment of shelling. I will also pick intestinal mud, by the way. Even noodles. Also especially imported from abroad. We would have liked to use the traditional, possibly coarse alkaline water surface, but then, Taiwanese people are not used to it. Since then we have been changing, change to the back to find this. Is using foreign noodles, more chewy. At the same time not too hard. It's a cheap price. Let everyone eat something different. Stir constantly while cooking. But not fully cooked. We want it to be semi-finished. And then, to the scene, do a quick stir fry. This will speed up the meals, faster. The cooked noodles have to be cooled. Let the air be filled with fresh noodle fragrance. It actually has some barley in it, so you will feel the smell of wheat. Complicated pre-material preparation operations. After you're done, no time to rest. Night market. Ready to spread.
Set off the canvas. The stall is positioned. Prepare money-making utensils. Turn on the light box. There will be guests coming soon. You want. One serving is not spicy. The night market is more lively. Business is better. I saw Lu Yunqian, fully fired. Frown and stir fry seriously. This busy. Barely had time to stop. Have been interested in catering since college. After graduating from the Japanese department, just stepped into the kitchen as an apprentice. Under the painstaking cooking. For food hygiene. Also deliberately shaved all the hair. Choking hot before the fire. Are common. Hands are too tired to have occupational diseases, but as long as the door-to-door -door customers, no matter how busy he is, he will be kind. Call them boss. Boss, wait a minute. Everyone is my boss. Everyone is willing to spend money to taste, so I never felt. I am the boss. I always feel like I'm just, just someone who cooks for everyone. Do things seriously and be humble. It's the way he runs his business. If the portion is not enough, can increase the price. Become Menghua meal. Food ingredients are upgraded. Meals can also be customized. I want a copy. Then the smell is not so heavy. It's okay, see if you want less oil and less salt. Or can be added, in addition to customization, when not busy. Hidden version menu. Put a half-boiled egg. The evil egg liquid flows out slowly. Combine a pot aroma of fried noodles. It's just freezing. About eating, times a week. Yes, come back. Because he did it late. I will buy it when I go home for supper. Customer waiting time. Sometimes a burst of fire. Just look at the skill of this fast frying. No wonder, sometimes you have to wait half an hour. Guests are willing to wait. Because in recent years, isn't everyone raising prices all the time? We started with 80 yuan. Two or three people come and say, you really don't rise. Up, why not up? The most important thing is to survive. Why don't you go up? Then I want to say I just listen. Because of one. Then, two, three, four. That's good news. If no one rises. Let's figure it out. So then we directly started from 80 yuan, adjusted to 90 yuan. Customers say it's good. I'll be fine. That's 90 yuan. It has been sold until now. It's thanks to the many guests. Willing to give us time to improve. Then also willing to encourage us to say, your price may be too cheap. Tuna more moderate. It is not easy for young people to start a business. You have to keep going even if you are struggling with costs. Fortunately, there's another half. I decided to quit my job for my husband. Work hard by your side. I think I can work hard with Mr. Create new experience and experience. It's a good thing. I dare not say in the future, but so far I feel, can still work hard. I still have motivation to continue, big and small problems. Maybe also, because we are the first time. Therefore, whether it is personnel, time, place. Maybe we all have new challenges. Can solve these things. It makes me feel more accomplished. Thank you for being a guest. Only when there are guests can we have us. So yes. There are too many people to thank. Actually, thank you. For example, my wife. Our work-study students. Or a guest. Don't dislike. Thank you all. Thanks everyone. Take your time. It's more important to do things well. One day it will succeed, right? I hope I believe. Hold an optimistic and diligent attitude. Start from scratch. Let everyone know his original cuisine. Lu Yunqian and his wife. Lu Yunqian and his wife. Hope someday can make the brand bigger. A plate of fried noodles. Let the couple love each other sooner or later. Hand in hand. Move towards the goal. Taoyuan Dashi is most famous for Doqian. There is a local family that has been passed down for three generations. Daily cooked and cut bean stew. Very popular with locals. There are long queues even on weekdays. The must-eat black bean thousand juicy cube bomb. Golden egg central medium. Also very mouth-watering. The two generations of this family work together. Never rubbed. Even came up with the low may bonus system. What kind of interesting pattern is this? Let's take a look. It's 12.13 noon. At this time, many people will want to come out, find something delicious. Then come to Dashi in Taoyuan, everyone's first thought, must eat tofu. You can see it behind me, long queue. They come to eat. This family's dried tofu. This store is in Taoyuan. It has a history of nearly half a century. Three dried tofu. Do you want to cut three black stems? Hundred pages tofu. What else? Up and down. Move the hot, lo mein neatly. Cut to good entrance size. This plate has just been installed. The ones behind have to catch up. I can't stop when I'm so busy. A plate of 100 page tofu with vegetarian chicken and vegetarian tripe. And this is bound to happen. Signature must eat black beans. It feels thicker and more cute. 
different right. Does it taste more solid? Yes. It's more tasty. It's dark outside. But I won't say how salty is. But I won't say how salty is. Very good taste. Once you bite it, it will burst full of soup. Tasty, but not too salty. To make such a taste, it's Zhang Minghui, from morning to night, all day long, staring at the boiler, in front of the brine piece, by piece. Especially this dried black bean. Specially made with alkaline water. Because tap water has a taste. Alkaline water tastes sweet. It tastes good. Same as the dried tofu sold in that market. It's chunky watery. Our dried tofu is smaller and more Q. Not only the unique zero bomb taste. And from daddy. Handed down second marinade. Add star anise and other spices to soy sauce. Different from ordinary lo mein. Many of them emphasize the use of old marinade. The bottom of the pot here is every morning. A pot of pot is boiled from scratch. This marinade has flour and soybeans. Relatively fermented and easily spoiled. Then we just say don't use the old one. Just replace it with a new one every day. It will be fragrant. If you use, when used repeatedly, that scent is not enough. A whole row of marinated pots is fully fired. Various ingredients are tossed in the soup. Control the size of the fire. How long should it be? Miao Fang is in Zhang Minghui's heart. Its hardness and softness depend on the feeling. It has a Q degree when you clamp like this. Raw things will be harder. A pot of marinade is boiling. Immediately ahead, there is a full crowd. Sorry to line up this way. It won't be dangerous if the car comes. The freezers in front of the stage are green as the lo mei under the arcade. One brine is dozens of years old. It wasn't here at first. It wasn't under the banyan tree over there before. Under a banyan tree at the corner of the main entrance of the park, over there was. When I was a child, I used a portable. The third sister, who is now over 50. Back then, she was a yellow-haired girl. Family of eight children. Ignorant, big and small. Every school lunchtime. Just run out and follow daddy. Sell, lo mei, under the tree. Mom and dad are here. Our children all go to the park to sell. You take it and go around to find someone, yes. Some students in class. Come here, for a picnic, right? We'll take it to the park. Sometimes it's sold until it's time for class. Too late to go to class. Also too late to eat. Back then, the banyan tree was still fluttering in the wind, but childhood memories never come back. The father who led everyone to sell, Lomei, passed away. Siblings grow up. Someone develops outward. Find your own piece of sky. Asan's sister-in-law is always guarding the small stall. Like when I pushed out the stall. I don't get home until night. Then there are no friends to chat with. Facing something every day. There were not so many guests back then. Still have to hold on to that stall. It's also tiring. But I've been through it, and I've survived it. Thoughts of giving up also came to mind. But the third sister is reluctant. Dad's blood is gone. Fortunately, brother Zhang Minghui, take the sign at home. And got all the sisters back. Family together. Hold on to this nostalgia. Gather the power of all. The items of lo mei are becoming more and more abundant. I have five kinds of flavors here. Five kinds, right. And including the small one. There are ten kinds. The hottest in summer is 40 degrees, really. The electric fan keeps blowing hot air. Almost 42, 43 degrees. Woke up at 6 o'clock in the morning. Until 5 or 6 in the evening. All day. None of the pots are resting. Let it cool immediately. To the booth. Looking around, there are more than 10 flavors. But you can't just let your younger brother be more beautiful than before. Look at this box of eggs. Also specially wrote the word Sanjia. Because it's her specialty. Golden eggs are different. Our golden eggs. Look inside. All the flavors go in. Usually it's white inside. Our golden eggs are doing comparison. Q. It won't be like this. Marinated duck eggs for 12 hours. The taste of seven kinds of medicinal materials including licorice. Infiltrate. The skin of duck eggs will be Q. Egg yolk taste. Like the eggs of mullet roe. QQs will not stick. This is done by medicine. So that there will be no fishy smell. The yolk on the outside of the egg is not Q. That egg is delicious. It seems a bit crunchy. It's okay if the taste isn't good, it's different. This golden egg is half-baked in the center. You can do whatever you want. Instead of a knife, use sewing thread. This is special. 
handed down from ancient times, old people used to say. You cut beautifully with this. So let's try really beautiful. When you watched me cut just now, the speed was very fast. Just cut it off. Cut it off and press it open it's beautiful. Because of its protein, there is also a slight soy sauce color. So the taste is also very tasty. And most importantly, its egg yolk is uncooked and delicious. Feeling sticky. The taste is heavier, but more delicious. Yes, it will be less tasteless. Not only the three sisters have captured the mouse of gourmets with good ingredients. In fact, the entire booth. Assortment of items. Many neighbors are called halogen and have masters. One signature dish for one person. Here's everyone's Lomé bonus system. The second sister is Hal and I have golden egg. The three sisters have three things. And sister-in-law. So enjoy the night really check out. It depends on how much you sell. Equivalent to more bonuses. Yes, it's like a bonus. Because the boss said, the sisters have been helping together since childhood, right? Later, the boss inherited. He said all the sisters came to help. Just a little bonus for you. This way everyone earns money. Working together never counts. Talking about my family. Third sister's face. I can't hide a smile. Start from sensible. Siblings work together. I have fought for most of my life. I have fought for most of my life. Friction is inevitable at work. But never really sparked. Because some guests come to talk. Your shop. Siblings all work together here. That's nice. I said yes, we are very united. Everyone like this. Rarely see such a united family. We now feel. The guest said so. We feel very relieved. We are fine sisters are fine. Start from the stall under the banyan tree. The whole family works together day by day. Not only to spell out the unique taste. Spell out the deepest emotions. Just like the taste in that memory. Persistent fragrance. Welcome to Attack on Taiwan. I'm Yiting. Take you to see the wonderful life of ordinary people. This one in Taoyuan. Xinjiang Special Cuisine Snacks. It's often not time to open the door. There are many customers queuing up. It looks like the signature Xinjiang glutinous rice in the store. After pulling the noodles into thin strips. Frying pan. Golden brown skin. Crisp with a hint of cumin. You can also be like shabu shabu. Soak the pan slightly. Let it soak up the mutton broth. Pair with hand-pulled noodles. Rich taste. And this sauce keel. With the sauce prepared by the boss. It's delicious to eat together. It's a must for gourmets. This store for me. I worked hard from scratch until today. Start from scratch. In my heart, it's 24 hours and never closed. Takeaway. The 200 yuan mutton soup is good. Nini, this order comes. Okay, then a tofu. One for ramen. Okay, I'll hurry up. I try to be as fast as possible. Several hot soup pots. Puffing smoke. Fast cutting sound. Mixed with the urging voice of the guests. Keep busy kitchen. Morning is like a battlefield. There are many things to do before opening the shop. Too much. Too busy. Too busy. I just make chili sauce and glutinous rice. I haven't slept for two days. Although it is a public holiday, there is no way. Sijiang Xia. Dexterously shuttle in front of the narrow hearth. One person has to be several people. How much to use? Not yet opening hours. Several guests. Already waiting hard at the door of the store. Why did you come here before the store opened? Miss this taste. And I haven't eaten for a long time. So I ran over here. Wait for her to open the door. Delicious food. We waited a long time. But we are still willing, because she's real. Eat with confidence. This unassuming little shop. Appearance looks rather inconspicuous. First pass. Often easy to miss. This is our famous sauce keel in Xinjiang. Very unique taste. Served with our Xinjiang sauce. Worth a try. Our sliver. It's very Q bomb. It tastes happy to chew, because it is pulled out by hand. Limited to fresh pull. Tiazi and Leishiazi. Perfect match with our Xinjiang Leishiazi. The glutinous rice in Xiaoxiao's mouth. Of ethnic minorities in Xinjiang. One of the famous flavors. Mainly made with white flour or glutinous rice. Deep fried. Because crispy and delicious. Often used as a gift. Then I start cutting slowly. But I also fail sometimes. It's not uncommon to cut dough with a knife. But with a bowl that is readily available. To cut the dough. Have you ever seen? Hard to grasp. Hard to catch. How many times failed? 
I failed countless times and times. Risen dough. Apply Xinjiang sesame oil. Follow the traditional way of home. Use a round bowl. Cut into long strips while drawing circles. This is Xinjiang's easy, unique way of making. The process is quite labor-intensive and time-consuming. A test of skill and patience. Who taught you to cut with a bowl? My grandma. My grandma cut it in a bowl. Really are. My grandma she did so beautifully. Women in Xinjiang, do they all use bowls to cut? Use bowls not knives. All in a bowl, because the bowl is round. Knife it is a. Cut it out, there are still edges and corners. Ugly. Cut noodles. To go through back and forth consolidation, then slowly stretch it to the desired thickness. In the process, if you are not careful, it will break. Then we have to rub the strips. To what extent? Make a circle. Rub a thickness. The degree you want. Do you remember when you first started trading? Where does it all fail? Fail. Thickly cut, thickly. Different thickness. Too dry and it will break, too dry and it will break. Therefore, the temperature and humidity must be controlled. Afraid it will break, so the speed must be fast. The person in front of me is skillfully pulling the dough. It is Zhang Xia who has been in Taiwan for 20 years, because I miss my hometown. Open a store in Taiwan. Sell authentic Xinjiang cuisine. I was born in Ely, in Ening. There is blue sky and white clouds. It is a place where cattle and sheep can be seen under the wind and grass. There are hills, plains, and mountains. Rugged. Riding a horse as a means of transportation. Herding sheep. That was my first job as a kid. Hated that job back then. Think about it now. Yes, it feels like herding sheep. After school is herding sheep. Recall childhood past. Think about it now. I thought it was a bit of a complaint back then. It turned out to be the purest beauty in my memory. I was so innocent and carefree back then. A sheep. The second is my grandpa and grandma. Opened in Xinjiang. It's the Xinjiang ramen shop. While herding sheep. We are in the shop on Sunday. Help my grandpa, help my grandma. Because my parents are teachers. That. The wages are not enough. I have many brothers and sisters. Except herding sheep. Just on Sunday. Just go to the store to help. I was born in a bad family, as children of the same age. When you can go out to play, Zhang Xia and siblings, get grandma and grandpa. I opened a ramen shop to help, so she was longing. Escape from this life, also introduced by friends. Meet Mr. from Taiwan. Decided to hold hands forever. Not even. If one by one, not so evenly. To what extent? Fried until golden brown, the chopsticks on both sides. This place is the most unfamiliar, be sure to separate it. Put the pulled noodles into the oil pan, fried to a golden color and taste crisp. Hezi is a festival in Xinjiang. Food that symbolizes reunion. It is also the time when local women want to get married, must learn craft. Super difficult to control every place. You have to control it well to be beautiful. Only delicious. You see this is golden yellow. Crispy taste. Otherwise. You have a small detail, cannot do well. That's all ruined. Especially this place. This place has to be just right. Must be cooked. Side by side right. The place on the side is very important. We just saw. The special way of making Xinjiang glutinous rice. White flour. Or glutinous rice to make. Deep fried. Because crispy and delicious. Often used as a gift. Zhang Xia from Xinjiang. Why do you want to taste the taste of your hometown? To Taiwan? Take you to see her story. Zhang Xia is frying the rice dumplings. I can't help but feel a lot of emotion. She had longed for marriage at the beginning. Because Mr. Who works in the printing industry. Investment failure. Overnight. Life is suddenly in trouble. Also lost more than 10 million. He lost too much money. It was really. Can't live. I can't go on. At that time. We have two kids. At that time, the salary of the employees. I can't send it out. At that time I was at home taking care of two children. I was already. The feeling of being at the end of the road. There is no tomorrow. Yes always feel. The feeling of the abyss. The two children were still very young. The so-called mother is strong. Zhang Xia must find a way to support the family. But she is not familiar with the place. Feel quite helpless. I missed my hometown so much. Go to Taipei. There is no real food in Xinjiang. Did not see. Really, they have all changed since they arrived in Taiwan. Changed taste. We are authentic. Start from scratch to get her. Piece together memories of helping out in the store as a child. I want to bring the taste of my hometown to Taiwan.
All the mud needs to be boiled for eight hours. The meat is soft and tender. The soup is thicker. The gelatin comes out and the soup turns milky white. What time did you start to boil? It was ready at 8 o'clock yesterday. Soup boiled for 10 hours. Milky white. Taste. Refreshing and non-greasy. Must use lamb knee. Different parts of sheep. The color of the soup, just appear different. Failed many times. Color is not the same. The concentration of the soup is different. Yes, it must be stewed with lamb knee. To drink real soup. That really takes slow work. Yes, it takes a lot of time. Gas is expensive. To be honest, the cost is too high. But at the beginning of the store, almost no guests. Let Zhang Xia once want to give up. I used to make 300 yuan a day. It's not earning, it's a turnover of 300 yuan. Because no one knows about the store. I lasted for more than two months at that time. Maybe I have a thick skin. Most people have already given up. I have a thick skin and a strong heart, right? So I keep going. I haven't made any money for more than two months. Without me, I have always lost. Used to work. The money I make working in a restaurant. I paid it all. Is he takeaway? Okay, then I'll pack a serving of dried tofu. Good 350 grams. Ask the boss if he wants spicy. Does the boss want spicy? Do you want spicy? If it's hot, give him chili peppers. If it's hot, give him chili peppers. Mom, what is this? He will come get the morel immediately. Isn't it beef tendon? Yes, beef tendon and morel. Because our family has been cooking food for a long time. When I was in elementary school. I did it when I was in the 5th and 6th grades of elementary school. Then came to help when I was very young. Then I feel very hard. So mom works harder. She worked really hard. Because from before. Just watch her do it all the time. The body sometimes. Just so tired. Have you ever persuaded her not to do it? Must have. She won't listen after I finish talking to her. She is still stubborn. Maybe it's personality that demands perfection, and that unyielding spirit. Zhang Xia insists on doing her best. Therefore, customers only need to eat once, will be like a demon. Come and report in two or three days. I like it very much. Human flavor. So that dick is for me, the one with the cumin seeds. The aroma that I bit down. I think it's very different, become more special. She's still stewed. Then the soup is still full of rich. Her face is chewy. Then it is very fragrant with special flour. The smell of that noodle. Insisting on quality has also made a good reputation, but because work is too busy. And Mr. have become parallel lines that do not intersect. Zhang Xia became a single mother, raising children alone. Hard work and stress along the way. She chooses to bear silently. While brothers and sisters became her strongest backing. Lift your hijab. Let me see your eyebrows. Your eyebrows are thin and long. Like the crescent moon on the tree. Sister, you have worked hard for so many years. We all see. But I really can't help you. She is strong. Thank her. She is my strongest backing. I really appreciate my sister. Without her, there would be no me. No today. Sister, thank you. Because of family support. Zhang Xia walks through the low tide with her strong will. Now she always has a smile on her face. No matter how big the wind and rain ahead, she hopes to make the 2,000 kilometers away. Good taste of home. Persistent fragrance. If one third of life spent time in prison, is there any hope in life after being released from prison? There's a low stall in Taiwan, 35 year old boss in Huan Yu. With a big bald head, he is a rehabilitated person. Only released from prison in 2017, in just two years, he relies on the solo flash cold brine developed by himself. Already opened three branches. His Lome method, very different from others. Stick to old marinade. On the contrary, it is exposed to the scorching heat every day. And then, to cook a new marinade. He even made the fried sugar color by himself. He said to make money you have to make money with peace of mind. Because I've done too many bad things in the past, during his imprisonment. Friends and relatives around. One after another strange death. Make him feel the world. There really is karma. When he gets out of prison, he's going to be a whole new self. Thought about it at first, to try another industry, but I thought I had a criminal record. Just a criminal record of the word robber. You don't have to look for anything. I like its mouth meat, then braised eggs and tribute balls. And bird plum juice is also delicious. 
is relatively tender, it's also quite generous, I think it will be more cost-effective. Worth it again. Secret recipe. It's just different from the outside. I have never tasted such a special taste. Sugar in the pot. Boiled amber. Like magma spewing bursts. The smoky sweet, burnt aroma. This is sugar color, this one comes out sugar colored. How much do I want this black? You can't be all black. I saw a boss with a big bald head. Zeng Huanyu, throw in a big handful of onions, garlic, and peppers. Go down and stir fry. This is how I do it. Will others do this? I don't know. Learn if you love it, and the sweat can't drip. That's why my waist is sore. I just want to stay away from it. He is 35 years old this year. He speaks like a quack. After all, the first half of his life, like a social action movie. One third, up to 11 years, spent time in prison, was not released from prison until 2017. But two years. He has opened three stores. It is by relying on its own original cold brine. Make a difference in Taoyuan. Welcome. Here again, what to eat. Vegetarian beef tendon. Good vegetarian tripe tendon. Not very salty, but very tasty. Each of its flavors, really special. Like this chicken but is cold. It tastes good too. The beef tendon is marinated enough. Very tasty. Small kitchen. The passion of three great furnaces. Let Sing Huan use bald head. Full of sweat. In order to realize my lonely dream, just shave a big bald head. It's easier to handle. I shaved off my hair with a razor. I don't have to cut people's hair. No need to dress up. Don't wash. The facial cleanser just washes the whole body. Now he speaks with ease. In fact, he braced this way. Also fell a lot. I lost a lot of food in exchange for it. This batch was used up unsuccessfully. Fail again. Because you can't marinate. If you think it's useless, just fall. Sugar is the worst. Sugar can be poured into two pots a day. The lo mei sold by Zeng Huanyu is cold stew. Will vary according to the ingredients. Smoke and cook for different times in stewed soup. After the marinade is fully absorbed. Take it chilled. Now the hot chicken legs are marinated. Zeng Huan you can't wait. Let us try. He is proud of his real kung fu. It will pick the juice. When you eat. I feel the meat is very tender and juicy. When it's cold. It tastes like boiled chicken. When hot it tastes like. People are grilling or frying chicken. When it's fried, just right. It's still juicy. When there is a lot of water. Braised mei can also be marinated like this. It's just right for you as long as you catch the time. If it's fresh chicken again. It's guaranteed to work like this. In fact, fresh chicken legs before transformation. Zeng Huanyu will first peel off the excess oil. He said his marinade. Only marinate one food. I am deeply afraid that a small link is not good. The whole pot tastes bad. Chicken. Beef and pork are stewed separately. I don't want cows and pigs. All mixed together. If you are like those. Marinate, 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 marinate again. Just feel like it's something. Not so good. So fresh. I hope to be healthy. I want to eat lo mei. Although it is a civilian snack. But now. Seems to have been hyped. It's not a civilian snack anymore. Duck wings are also great. Like I just kept eating. Ordered two. Eat all the time. Cannot stop. Does it look like a bone? It can also absorb the soup inside. Current guest. Eat healthy and delicious. Eat healthy and delicious. In order to be immortal. Zen Huanyu did the opposite. Old brine is brine brightened. Bright and transparent and black. Fragrant and delicious. But it's high in sodium and purin. You send it for testing. You can know its result. I can't eat that myself. Then I can't cater to all the guests. But my insistence is. I want to be able to eat the original taste of the ingredients. That's what I'm after. Why do you often come to buy? Because the marinade here is very special. Different from others. Others are relatively dead salty. This one is where you can eat the original taste of meat. Because the emphasis is on the freshness of marinade. So I have to cook every day. Zeng Huanyu used more than 10 kinds of Chinese medicinal materials. And spices. This is anise. This is cumin. The aroma of cumin is quite right. This is pepper. Everyone should understand this. This is our finely ground cinnamon. Ordinary, low mei shops won't let you take pictures of this, right? We'll pack a bag for us to shoot. All in one bag. That's boring. That's boring. Don't be so mean. 
Sing Huan Yu speaks a lot about the Lomei classics. His mechanic was inherited from his mother. His mechanic was inherited from his mother. All that's left is to ask people around. Unique Kung Fu. And shop to save money. From the interior of the store. When it comes to Lomei home delivery, you come by yourself. I saw him with a knife. I saw him with a knife. Petting carton packaging. Busy hands. With scars of different shades. It was the beginning of middle school. The absurd years of youthful blood. National and high schools have. Just quarrel with people. Others choke me. I might just move a knife. I'll kill him like this. He cut me and I cut him like this. Also has bullet holes. Of course there are bullet holes. There's a bullet hole in the back. Did someone shoot you? Sing Huan Yu in the wandering boyhood. All day swords and blood. There is a resistance to the real environment behind it. Parents divorced early years. A mother alone has to take care of three children. He can't help. Material satisfaction. Can only vent in this way. But never thought that in high school. And unraged junior high school girls. Had sex and was sentenced. Got a girlfriend. Then she was sued by her family. Some of them once wanted to talk about reconciliation. But can't talk. Of course I don't want to. So go in and close this. The first time I was in prison for more than two years, after he was released from prison, I had been an egg dealer, worked in the funeral business. People with money still have no goals. Drug addicted. Take my brother to grab a supermarket. What's the process like? Actually, I don't remember clearly. Actually, I don't remember clearly. Because only vaguely no. We have been there. What did you forget? Why did you forget when you got home and fell asleep? Yes, during this period. Forever blank blank. Sentenced to eight years this time. Until a series of misfortunes occur. Only Zheng Huan Yu came to his senses. Does the family travel a lot? A lot of. Dad and aunt. Grandma my child. A younger sister is his, brother's, fiancé. That moment is tense. That's really tense right now. Would be nervous to say, will my mother be next? Would think so. Then I was thinking about saying. How long is my life left? Release day. He was alone in front of Guishan Taipei prison. Thought for half an hour. I'm different from others. I know that when many people step out. I want to buy beer. I'm going to have a good time. I'm going to play. But I'm right now. Is completely without feeling. I'm thinking about what's next for my future. What should I do? Sun Huan Yu has a quick mind. I saw logistics vehicles all over the street. He volunteered to be a driver. Even after being shut down. Stayed at the door for three days and moved the other party. But he asked for twice the salary. Think I'm crazy. How can anyone pay that kind of salary as soon as they come? What I was talking to him about was, I have a way to increase the profit of the company. That I can adjust all your routes. I opened it with him on the condition that, I have a way to shorten all your shipping times. I can also work overtime. Yes, call me and I will come. I will come if there is no one. With a flexible mind. Been a logistics driver for a while. But he saw his brother. After being released from prison, finding a job always hits a wall. So I decided to find my family. Let's sell Lomei together. Actually thought about it. Be honest or lie. Say I have no criminal record. But then think about it. If half done, what did they find? I don't know, because I don't understand this. I don't know if they will actually check. I always ask if I have any previous convictions. I always say it directly. I have a criminal record like this. The brothers often stand at the counter alone. A person is busy cutting Lomei. Gradually made a name in Taoyuan. Enemies will come for me. Yes, it's sour. Let's see if I will do it. There's nothing to fight about. Because there are wives and children. Also have a family. Others look down on me. It's their business, right? Don't want onions, right? Don't want all. Sweet and spicy duck wings. The lo mei sold by Zhang Huanyu. Take the southern sweet route. It's because he cares about health. No chemical sauces and seasonings. By frying sugar. Let's color the lo mei. Like dry bean curd and pork blood cake. Sweet and spicy beef triple duck wing. 100 pages tofu. Every taste. Looks like it's in beauty mode. Look oily and juicy. Even Lomei shop. Sold at night. There are still a large number of. Diehard fans. Is it soup? I think it's locked inside. Yes, it doesn't matter if it's dried tofu. Or braise 800 pages. 100 pages are juicier. Personally, I think I quite like it. Personally, I think I quite like it. Sun Huan Yu regained his freedom. In order to make my life. From now on, light a bright light. People do business. People do business. Posted on Kiyuang Guangjin. What is posted is this kind of life principle. What he posted is this kind of life principle. Grasping the present means. You gotta cherish every moment you can breathe. I often see some social news. It's just trivial things. No big deal. Why don't you know how to cherish? Sun Huan Yu making braised meat. In fact, there is another dream. 
just to encourage rehabilitated people to be like him. As long as you keep your feet on the ground, there will be a day of success.